Kanpur is a big industrial city. A lot of industries are there. People come from outside. It is a business hub for textile, for leather, for different sorts of industries. So that's why there was a need of a mass rapid transit system, and that's how the Kanpur Metro project came. So Kanpur, when we started, I had a team which was already trained as compared to Lucknow when I was building my team also. So this time we were in a better position. Kanpur is two corridors, uh, north, south, east, west, and uh, the north corridor starts from IIT Kanpur, which is in the north. Then it goes uh, through the complete central area, to very thickly populated markets like Navi Market, Bada Choraha, then railway station, which is the main Kanpur central station, and then there is a bus stop and goes up to a transport nagar, which total length is about 23 and a half kilometer. On the GT road, where we started my priority corridor from IIT Kanpur to Moti Jhil, which is in itself is a long corridor, nine kilometer, little more than nine kilometer, with nine elevated stations. There were huge challenges in the Kanpur in, in terms of the implementing a metro project because road widths are limited and uh, traffic congestion is too high. In that portion, the railway lines are running parallel to the metro or the GT road where metro alignment is passing, elevated. There are total about 18 level crossings. So my concourse is almost entirely precast. We designed a double T girder. We just placed in the night time above the road. And that's how we completed our concourse very fast. And a lot of a standardization of designs. So that same girder is used continuously from one place to another place. So contractor doesn't have to do multiplicity of the things. And my delivery of the trains is very fast. So you can think it is just two years since we started our train tracks. So Kanpur also we converted from overhead traction to 750 volt DC traction means along with the two rails there is a third rail which will, from where the power will be drawn. So it will be aesthetically more pleasing as compared to Lucknow because there will be no overhead wires in the city. We are the leading uh, company in metro segment. We have already constructed 120 kilometer plus underground and elevated metro rail in India. The name of the project is Construction of elevated viaduct, including nine elevated metro stations. We focus all these three material, manpower and machinery. Not a single day of this project has been delayed due to the material, though we have faced two COVID webs during the construction. This project consists of 50% precast and 50% of cast density. We have to set up the casting yard in the center of the alignment. Our labor camp is the center in alignment and luckily we have found out the place and within 60 days we have set up our casting yard. So, cast in situ works involves a lot of time because it should be done at site. A staging, then the traffic management. After redesigning, we have reduced the cantilever pier from 25 to 40 numbers. The time period given for this project is 21 months. The company AFCONS is known for its delivery culture, deliver the project in time or within the time schedule. It is a success of all my contractors, even subcontractors, their vendors, even the workmen who do the work outside, along with my own team and my general concept. Lastly, we have completed the fastest metro Nine stations in 9.6 kilometer within time.